This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Friday, February 17th. Two former Holland America Line ships are set to become floating homes through the river cruise company Victoria Cruises Line. The former Veen Dam and former Rhine Dam have been renamed Victoria Majestic and Victoria Amazing and are scheduled to begin operating as houseboats this spring. Their around-the-world trips will set sail from Port Everglades and take around 27 months each. They'll spend one day to one week at most ports of call. Only open to adults, the staterooms and suites can be rented for a minimum of six months or long-term for as long as you want. Both ships include free Wi-Fi. Victoria Cruises Line currently operates seven river ships on China's Yangtze River. Leases for these floating homes, well, $6,300 a month for an interior cabin. And the Cayman Islands exceeded its 2022 visitors goal, welcoming over 1,027,000 travelers, including over 700,000 cruise passengers and 261 ship calls last year. Director of Tourism Rosa Harris attributed pent-up demand for travel and the quality of the Cayman Islands tourism offerings for the huge number of visitors. This year, Cayman is scheduled to receive 403 cruise ship calls and one anchor from NCL Prima on the seabed, if you want to count that. And Carnival welcomed a new four-legged member to its diamond status during a cruise on Carnival celebration last week. A retired U.S. Army service dog named Sarge reached the highest tier in Carnival's VIFP loyalty program, achieving over 200 nights spent at sea with Carnival. The K-9 was honored during the ship's Platinum and Diamond loyalty event for the achievement. The 14-year-old dog has spent most of his life serving in the military and now lives and travels with his owner, Justin Markham Sr., who is also a Diamond member. What a fun story. And the photo of the week this week comes from Rosalia of Carnival Radiance, taken in the cruise industry's favorite port of convenience, Ensenada, Mexico. Great picture there. You can email your photo to Doug at cruiseradio.net. All photos are subject to air. And cruise line stocks were down on Thursday. Carnival Corporation down 4.8%, 11.60. Royal Caribbean down 2.4%, 73.92. And Norwegian down 1.7%, 17.80. Breaking news and industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Have a tip or a lead on a news story? Let us know. Email tips at cruiseradio.net.